quarter in a game that may be already out of hand. The Clippers shooting just 29% in this game. They are not a pretty sight out there offensively. And Phoenix looking who they've got on the floor. Torrey Craig is out there with Warren. Then it's Durant. Then it's Chris Paul. And it's Lee in at the two spot. Durant finds Paul. And he gets it to go. Every team wishes they had a star like CP3, who provides whatever you need when you need it. Oh, what an impressive dribble drive. That replay brought to you by Mobile One. And a drive like that one can be a knockout punch. Great finish at this juncture. And it's George missing. They are losing because he is struggling so bad, and he has not looked comfortable all game. Over in the corner, Batum takes the three. And again, it's the Clippers missing. And so it's Paul with it, bringing it up for the Suns. They lead by the biggest margin of the game, 25. He knocked down a three in the first quarter, but he's still been unable to connect from deep past the break. Here's Powell. Banked in off the glass. Norman. And no matter what they've tried, the D just has not been able to deny them the ball inside. Duran against George. Warren kicks to Lee. Paul surveying the floor. Fires it up. And it falls over the rim and in. Paul's got four points this quarter. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Yeah, as soon as these guys feel contact, they are just disappearing like they're not even there. You got to show some fire and keep defending. Highland misses. For Phoenix, they've gone 2 of 4 from the field since we started the final quarter of play. A shot by Paul, no good. For Los Angeles, they've gone 1 of 5 from the field here in the fourth. A lot of misses, just the one mate has to pop. And here's Batum. Shot clock at 6. to Highland. Here's Plumley. Got a hand on it. And for those who have questions about Warren's defense, there's his answer. And Chris Paul Chris the bucket Paul. on the assist by the Durant. Durant's Durant. got four assists now tonight. Let's look at the energy stats, how the hustle game has been going for the Suns. The pass to Powell. Batum trying to break loose. The shot by Powell, no good. Phoenix has gone three of five from beyond the arc so far tonight. Batum against Paul. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. Another bucket down low. They've been the aggressors taking the ball inside and attacking at the rim. And the Clippers going with a whole new group out there. A big group substitution here for Phoenix. Landale's checked in. Biambo comes Chris in for Torrey Gray. Akogi's checked in for Kevin Durant. And Terrence Ross is subbed in for Lee. Outside Gordon. Austin the pass to Mann. Ball's knocked loose. Ross with the steal. Now here's Paul. Not a lot of room. Bucket is good. Paul's got 15 points here in the second half. Offensively, defensively, they are in total control. And guys, to go on a big run, get some breathing space. It has to be a great play on each end. And again, no good by the Clippers. Boy, you can just see the frustration growing on their faces. Nothing going their way in a major drought need to find some sort of momentum and their balanced effort at both ends has hushed this crowd they've played fantastic ball and you can feel the hush that's come over this crowd Austin no good and it's Phoenix's ball outpacing him right now in a 15-2 run comes up empty down low and the activity he shows around the rim is why he is such a respected defender. Yeah, you can see why he's established that reputation. Strong understanding of how to defend at the rim. 
to the middle. Six on the shot clock and the basket by Gordon. And so it's going to end up in the record books as a blowout, a dominating performance for the Suns. You don't see this kind of a blowout often, but tonight this is a quality win across the board to deliver out uh, this kind of punishment. They definitely never changed the approach. They just kept after it and showed they were clearly the better team in just about every single category. And every win important. And this one will go down as win number three. They can chalk this one up, but these two teams will see plenty more of one another before the season's over. And we watched one guy all night long, guys. And look at the stats. Just confirms what a dominant game he had. What a night tonight it was for Chris Paul. And he was getting buckets all night long, giving the defense that work. And the Clippers making a change here. Zubats is checked in, and Chris Paul picks up the foul. That's his third foul of the game. Here's Mann, defended by Paul. Passes to Zubats. Here's Mann. Pass to Boston. against the Sun. Jock Landale. First personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for your Clippers. B.J. Boston. Two the first one falls. And he makes both free throws. And so it's Paul with it. Bringing it up for Phoenix. So far in the fourth quarter, they've allowed just six points. Oh, good with the triple. Just one second between the shot clock and game clock. Gordon, with no one around, hits the three-point bomb. It is so many of Gordon's shots come from three-point range because he drains so many of them. When you've had his kind of success from beyond the arc, you're always going to have the green light. Al Paul. Top of the key. No good. So it's the Suns winning easily here.